Hey everybody, this is Francella. I'm CJLO Station Manager. I also host Super Connected, which you can hear every Monday at 11 a.m. to noon. Hello, my name is Allison O'Reilly. I am the Program Director at CJLO 1690 AM, and I also host a radio show every Tuesday at 6 p.m. called Transistor Sister. Hi, my name is Lisa, and I'm the Volunteer Coordinator for CJLO. Hey, my name's Hunter, and I'm a DJ at CJLO. I'm also a copy editor for their online magazine. Hey, this is your baby boy Prince Rara in the building and I am a DJ at CJLO with my own show called Know the Culture. Hi everyone, my name is Chloe and I'm an assistant videographer at CJLO 1690 AM. Hi, I'm Jasper, host of the Party at Marketer, live every Tuesday at 5. Hey guys, uh, my name is Ryan aka DJ Slurp. I'm the other half of Mouse Party with DJ Razzmatazz. Greetings, I am Sass, aka DJ Razzmatazz, one half of Mouse Party, and I'm here to tell you to protect community radio at all costs. Without my wonderful weekly show at CJLO, I wouldn't have a reason to discover new music, show it off, and also be part of a super cool community of like-minded music lovers. Next month marks five years that I've been with CJLO. I've always wanted to work in radio and CJLO provided that opportunity. And now I'm working in a commercial radio station, but CJLO is still my first radio family. I just love having the opportunity to play whatever I want on the radio, whether that's metal, punk, or weird industrial noise. Now, I've been working at CJLO for almost four years, and in my time at this station, I have seen so many students and community members become truly talented broadcasters, develop so many incredible skills, and really contribute to the community in such a positive way by being involved with CJLO. We are more than a radio station. We're a community where we share ideas, talents, and productivity. I just quickly wanted to say that community radio is important because it gives an amazing platform to people from all different walks of life to have their voices heard in their communities. And perhaps now more than ever, that is important. It's wicked for creativity and also for the community, but it also helps artists in the community too. Humans rely on creative expression and that's what we here at CJLO do best. So donate now, get your very own tax deductible receipt, because we're staying alive. If someone were to ask me what CJLO means to me, I'd probably say that they're just a really important um, pillar in the local Montreal cultural landscape. Um, they give people an opportunity to have their voice be heard, which otherwise wouldn't happen, an opportunity to have their music taste be heard, and I think that's just really important. Um, but now it's your time to give back to CJLO. You can visit www.cglo.com as part of our fundraising initiative. And did I mention that we're also doing charitable tax receipts this year? What are you waiting for? Happy donating. Help us to support our creativity at home and continue to deliver shows 24-7. This is CJLO's funding drive. We're right in the middle of our funding drive. Uh, I know we want to do some more creative and innovative programming. I know for me personally, I would like to do more deep dives of albums. I just concluded a limited series on public strain by women. I'd like to do more of this, but I can't do it without your support. So be sure to go to cjlo.com slash donate to give something to CJLO during our funding drive. Thank you, everybody. Here we are raising money to give back to our incredible community. And this year we are giving away charitable tax receipts for the first time, so you can get back what you give. Thank you so much for supporting CJLO 1690 AM. Like I said, it's a great community that deserves to stick around after this pandemic is over and we need your help. Thank you so much. Bye.